You have insulted everybody. Every cast member up here, you insult everyone. Okay, what the it's hell not is my so turn. It's not my you? turn. Hey, you had your turn yesterday. Oh, be quiet. Jenny has had it with Big Ed. The way she told him to be quiet gave me flashbacks to my childhood. Oh, be quiet. Jenny goes off on Big Ed for his behavior toward the cast. You're so rude to everybody, oh, seriously. Find me a river. He is, man. He's the worst thing I've ever met in my life. She called him a thing. <laughs> And she isn't the only one fed up. Yeah, I'm just gonna tell you, you're lucky the going on in the studio because if not, somebody would probably beat your ass for talking to people's women the way you do. I wonder if that somebody is Jovi. Plus, Jenny, Angela, Kim, and Liz become the girlfriend group you never expected. But there's this move that he does. We call it the power bike. Goddamn, <laughs> that's all I'm gonna say. I think I'm calling Jesus when this happens. It's bad. Sorry, oh God, he's Well, I'm kind of pissed. I ain't called Jesus yet. <laughs> I call Jesus. They were a fun time. Let's get into it. Hey, Money Day fans fam. It's Melicia. I hope you're doing well. We have made it to the fourth and final part of the tell-all. To be honest, I thought this episode was going to be a little blah because they stretched the tell-all out so much. But to my surprise, I was entertained. In large part, thanks to Jenny. Jenny went from being the quiet one in the corner to snapping on Ed for everybody. Here's how it went down. Jovi is a provider. Whether you like it or not, he is, he is a your provider. provider. Yeah, he, he is your protector. Has a job. You should have never married him. And now you're looking for a, a B plan B. Ed started to give his two cents on Jovi and Yara's relationship, going hard for no reason. Why should you're I looking for a, a B plan B. I'm not looking for a Oh, do you? I, yes, you I are. Such a user like you are. Now I'm the last person who okay, will take the opinion. You don't okay? respect Jovi, number keep one. Keep and that's why he doesn't respect yourself, you. Dude. So instead of supporting him, I'm supporting you're going to bolt to Europe. I'm you're looking for a to way Europe. out. That's so stupid. And Jovi, I don't like you, but in this situation. All right, can we shut him up already? Nobody wants to hear it. Nobody wants to hear this. Nobody wants to hear this. You're a, you're a crybaby. Is this a kindergarten classroom? That's what it sounds like. <laughs> Come on, Ed. Every attack or everything you think is an attack doesn't need a reaction, especially not an immature one. This was the boiling point for Jenny. You're a crybaby. How'd you be quiet? Shoe fly, don't bother me. How'd you be quiet? I about had enough of this guy. Insults everybody. Why would you say Jovi's crybaby? You have insulted everybody. Every cast member up here, you insult everyone. Okay, what the it's hell not is my turn. It's not my you. turn. Hey, you had your turn yesterday. Oh, be quiet. You had Don't your turn ahead yesterday. Don't insult everybody. Stop you, it. You had your turn yesterday. It's not really? about you. You had your turn. My turn is whenever I want to take my turn. Stop. You had my your turn. My turn is not when you tell me to. Oh, he made Jenny get out her chair. You had your turn yesterday. Kiss my ass, dude. So shut up. Whoa. <gasps> you shut up. Am I the only one who was thinking, Smith, what you gonna do? <laughs> Big Ed is coming for your lady, what you gonna do? Clearly, Jenny can hold her own, but I would have loved to see Smith's reaction if he was there in person at the tell-all. Over Zoom, he didn't do much. You're so rude to everybody, oh, seriously. Find me a river. <laughs> Ed just says whatever. It's the worst thing I've ever met in my life. As Jenny calms down a bit, the conversation turns back to Jovi and Yara's issues. Mainly that Yara's friends haven't seemed to be too supportive of her being with Jovi in the past. When it comes down to it, I'm not in the relationship with Jovi and Yara. I'm Yara's friend, so I'm in the interest of her best interest. So they get a divorce because you support her. Why? Why? I'm not getting divorced. What are you talking about? Yeah. You guys are jumping to conclusions. So I love hilarious. Yara and Jovi together. You're being a wuss. You can't even manage your family. You're not man enough to manage your family. Shida's face is mine right now. It's like, what? <laughs> He's stuck in that mentality of, you attack me, I'm gonna say the worst possible thing and attack you back. It's a protective mechanism that it's no longer serving him. I'm sure it stopped serving him a long time ago. We are adults now, Ed. You don't have to protect yourself on the playground anymore. You wanna buy a place in Prague, didn't I hear that? I buy, In yes. your name, in your daughter's name, not in his name. On in Albert. you and your daughter's yeah. name. You never mentioned him oh, until you got busted. Oh, well, Busted. Listen, what you talking? You yesterday get busted, okay? Transparency. You guys are so, so transparent. So you, because you start to shame me, you try to. And uh, Jovi's a wuss. Me. Shut up. Your husband because is a wuss. Because you start to shame me, you try to show the shame. Your husband me. is I a wussy. Like you. You Ed, should... shut the f 
Um, nobody wants to hear you You're anymore. You're a pussy. You're a pussy. No, I'm serious. Jovi couldn't even take Ed seriously. You're a pussy. No, I'm serious. Look you are you. a pussy. I mean that. This is so You're hard. letting her ruin your life, what dude. What is wrong with y'all? Y'all all need to grow up. Oh, my gosh. Ed, how old are you? Wait, do y'all see Ed's reaction? His eyes got super big. That's not the first time I've seen him do that either. It happens whenever he gets called out or caught for doing something wrong. Ed, how old are you? Me and my empathetic behind wants Ed to go get some help. He's obviously struggled with some self-esteem hurdles, which is understandable. I'm sure since he was a kid, he's had to defend himself against people who would talk about him. But this persona he's created to protect himself is now destroying the positive relationships he could have as an adult. I'm sure it won't be an easy process, but it's time to mature, Big Ed. Gotta grow up. At this point, just drop the big and be Ed. As a matter of fact, you're Edward. Oh, you were gonna shut the door and leave me out? Or, oh, big Ed. He's little Ed. Why is Big Ed? <laughs> He's little Ed. He ain't no Big Ed. The tell-all wraps, and Jenny, Kim, and Yara get into one car, headed to the after party. And y'all, Jenny has this side to her that is just now coming out on the show, and I love it. Jenny is cool. He always drove some shade. And yeah, <laughs> when he told me to shut the <laughs> up, I looked at Yara. I did not first thing, I looked at Yara like, it's talking to me. When you got mad, I was like, in my head, I'm like, go Jenny. Oh go yeah, Jenny. I was like that too. I was like, yeah. You called it, you called it man. You yeah. Called it. Well, you somebody like, had to do up. it. Who does he think he is? Mm -hmm. How dare he? Say anything to anybody. Look at him. Mm -hmm. Is he perfect? Hell no. Don't worry from about it. <laughs> Jenny and that hell no had me laughing out loud multiple times. I kept rewinding this moment. Anybody look at him. Mm -hmm. Is he perfect? Hell no. Anybody look at him. Mm -hmm. Is he perfect? Hell no. What's up, Jenny? Come hang. Let's go get a drink, girl. I am here for this. Meanwhile, while the girls are kikiing in one car, Jovi is in another with Ed. And just like Jenny, I appreciate seeing this side of Jovi as well. Yesterday sucked, and um, today I just came out swinging. Anybody that took me down, I'm, I was gonna take him down. Yeah, I'm just gonna tell you, you're lucky the going on in the studio, because if not, somebody would probably beat your ass for oh. talking to people's women the way you do. Wow, chivalry is not dead. Go Yara. Jovi isn't perfect, but the way he kept his tone calm but direct is attractive. If a woman goes after you, you do not handle the situation that way. You can fight back, but you don't need to get aggressive and you don't need to scream at a woman, including my wife. Well, what about you? Including Jenny. What about you? I didn't scream at any woman in there. Big Ed goes on to admit his behavior during the tell-all was out of line especially toward Liz. I'm ashamed of the way I behaved yesterday. There's no yeah. excuse for that. Because you took it over the top to a point where we had no choice but to go after you instead of her. Absolutely. And you did the right thing. I was mad. Ed also has this habit of acting out and then apologizing right after, which Jovi and Yara call out once they get to the hotel. He is such a clone. That's his thing. He's a Clone, a clown. Who will say, clown, yes. That was cute. Who's saying one stupid thing and he apologized. Yeah. You're so dumb. Don't say that stuff. The, for, the, for you, after, don't apologize. I can't, I can't take anyone That's like Ed serious apologize. because he's like, oh, Jovi, you're, you're a pussy, you're a bitch, whatever. And then like, oh, I'm so sorry. Like, how old are you? Like, are you seven years old or what? Like, come on. Well, when it comes to Ed's fiance, Liz, she says after all his lies and deception, including being on a dating app and talking to his ex, Rose, she's done with him. She claims she's gonna focus on herself, so hopefully she sticks with that. He's a liar. He'll never change his behavior. Period. Liz also has Jenny to give her that extra boost after calling it quits with Ed. You deserve so much better. What are you doing with that guy? Oof, we all need friends like that after a breakup. Boy, I tell you. Okay, real quick, I gotta tell you. So my new license plate that I just put on my car. Don't tell me it says Big Ed. <laughs> it says Big Ed's girl. And now I gotta go. I'm gonna punch you in the face. <laughs> right now. Liz, Kim, Jenny, and Angela also end up having this girl chat moment that I didn't know I needed to see from them. It was a little uncomfortable at some points, but 
Overall, a good time. I'm gonna say this, because we're all having a fun time, but she's so full of Because I'm telling you, I see her heart, and she's so much like me, she's too forgiving, she don't talk No one's gonna tell Angela she has a nip slip? But somehow, another guarantee you, you're gonna see the romance spark again. No, it won't. Mark my word. I mean, I might go get some but I might go get some You don't gotta fly that, that far away to get you're so right. Angela goes from telling Kim she's going to get back with Usman to asking how was their intimacy together. So is it good? Yes. Is so... it good? Yes. And let me tell you, it's 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 um different than what I've been used to. I will say my face is red as <laughs> right? But it's good. I know. But it's been an overtime thing. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yep. Did I you guys want to go back? Anything? Um, yes. But there's this move that he does. We call it the power bike. God damn. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. I think I'm calling Jesus when this happens. It's bad. Sorry, oh God. He's well, I'm kind of pissed. I ain't called Jesus yet. <laughs> I called Jesus. <laughs> I'm just saying. The ladies then turn to Jenny and ask how Submit is in bed. Yes, Jenny, Jenny, Submit is perfect for me, okay? Wait. Jenny said, That's all you need to know. <laughs> there is always that one friend who was like, I'm not telling y'all my business. And my thought is, girl, relax. We don't care that much. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm not mad at it. To be real, some friends, mm -mm, you don't need to tell them about your intimate moments with your partner. And you know why. Curiosity killed the cat. So what is, what's the favorite thing he does before y'all have sex? Does he kiss you, caress you? Massage. Gives really nice massages. You know, my neck always hurts on the side. I bet it does. Shut up. <laughs> I bet. He's too silent. Yeah, you're such a silly girl, you silly girl. You love me, though. Angela goes on to detail her sex life with Michael. Well, I'll tell you what Michael does. Do we it's have not to very know? Exciting. <laughs> Jenny. Jenny is my favorite cast member on this tell all. It's not very know. exciting. Yeah, it's not. But, but he tries. But he's very good because I teach him, right? Mm -hmm. so, <laughs> Don't worry. I've had to teach yeah. my last partner for the last two years, and he still can't kiss. Yeah. I want to tell you this. All he thought about was. You take your clothes off and you have sex. It's the first You go day. in. I'm older, number one. Uh, yeah, I got juices, but you got to flow them. Like, oh, my God, Angela. It's the truth. We're older women. Well, true. Like, true. she probably can just, one can go her because it's <laughs> young. Ours is older and you got to play with us. I never, like a, yeah. It's the truth. Some of y'all OK out there? <laughs> just checking. The girl chat ends with the ladies toasting to the single life and Jenny joining in for moral support. I'm gonna say this. Cheers to a very healthy relationship. Cheers to two single women. Possible three. Possibly three. And oh, if you're single, we are all going out. To me being single. To me being single. Possibly you're so full of <laughs> Shut up. You're gonna go back to Michael too. I can hear your voice now. Bitch, I can hear your voice now. Michael! I never said I wasn't. Look at Angela talking about I never said I wasn't. She's not tired yet. <laughs> wow. Endurance. All right, next week is the premiere of season four of 90 Day Fiance The Other Way. And we have some new couples to get to know. Osama. He makes me feel young again. Are you okay, my love? I'm really homesick. Ooh, cross fingers, let's hope they're actually interesting. That will make my job a lot easier. <laughs> All right, 90 Day fans fam, this season of Happily Ever After was fun. As always, I appreciate you so much. So, so much. Make sure you stick with ET because we are covering it all. I will see you next time.